Hello everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to set up your keyboard and mouse with your Cronus Zen. So first of all, open up your Zen Studios. So after you open your Zen Studios, take your micro USB key wire, the longest one, and plug it on the right side of your Chi uh, Zen. So after you plug it in, go to the MNK settings. Okay. So, so the first thing you need to do is to go down in the description. I will upload my MNK settings down below. Just import them by going to uh, by taking on this import layout and go to download. But I I already have linked it down in the description to just install it, and you will see if it's T3 Kicks personal. Just open it up, and it's gonna save your, and it's gonna open up your settings, which through which you can use your Zen with your MNK. So after that's done and it's set up, go to your device and plug in your micro USB CUI which updates your firmware uh, on the top of the Zen after it's plugged in it's gonna recognize it as a console which is Xbox because I'm gonna be using uh, Xbox controller to show you so after you after I connect my controller wire on the right side of the Zen, which is the A1 port, and as you guys can see, it just turned on and it's connected to my Zen right now, and it has been connected with my controller. So after you have done that, and your uh, Xbox controller is with the then then take your keyboard and mouse USB wire I'm gonna be using uh, Logitech G502 Hero mouse to show you and plug it on the A2 port of the Zen this is the A2 port plug in your mouse and then take your keyboard wire and plug it in your A3 port and as you guys can see it turned green on both sides I'm gonna plug in my uh, micro USB key wire the longest wire which you get with your Zen and as you guys can see there it shows how it has been connected with the keyboard mouse and the job pad which is the Xbox controller okay also make sure you have an extra mouse on your Zen Studios. So go to MNK settings after your hair. Go to your game settings and bind all of these with your in-game settings. Like for B and Vorjon, it's for slide cancel. So I have it on C on my keyboard. After that's all of it is done. Uh, you can customize this if you want, but I don't recommend to customize or change anything here. You need to change everything in your game settings. Just import and save it on your Zen by clicking on this. Now it should save the settings. And after that's done, just go on to your game and customize the sensitivity, the keybinds. Also, you need to make sure your mouse uh, is 4000 DPI or plus 4000. So it's really smooth in game. And so now I'm gonna show you that this is the mouse and my keyboard. And I'm gonna wait one second. This and as you just can see, I just changed the layout from there to the keyboard layout. So now I'm gonna just scroll through. I'm, I just uh, I will press the down button, which is gonna take it down and you can see that it's actually a controller connected with the, um, with the game 
okay and for them I press space and here I will show you when I move my mouse it's actually moving and controller the sense is a little low because I need to adjust my own sense but as you can see the binds are all controllers And it's really easy to set up. Uh, and as you can see, the input device is as the controller even though I have my mouse and keyboard connected. So Okay. Mm, okay. For this, uh, the settings I'm gonna show you is for Warzone. So just press A, and these are the settings you should use with my profile. Five hundred, five hundred, and zero zeros. After that's done, uh, I'm gonna move to the next one. for this but all of these should be 2020 and for the ADS sensitive multiplier you can adjust it to the liking but I recommend to be like above 2 because if, if, if it's not above 2 it's, it's gonna be really laggy okay um, for the aim response it should be dynamic for this ADS sensitive transmission instant Black Ops, the best one, which is gonna work with the Zen. Okay. So, as you can see, I'm moving with my keyboard and mouse. I'm not using my controller as I did. Thank you for watching the video. If you guys enjoy it, like, subscribe, and comment any problems you have. And if you guys want to buy those uh, scripts, Go check my Patreon best scripts in the market, Zero Recall and like Aimbot, Aimbot.